Even though presidential candidates are no longer shaking hands and kissing babies, the race for the White House hasn't stopped. Welcome to our very first Latinos for Trump online town hall. We're operating entirely digitally. Trump campaign press secretary Kayleigh McEnany says the campaign is now reaching voters online. Essentially doing virtual town halls, virtual uh, ways to connect with our supporters. The Trump campaign says its online campaign reached more than 1 million viewers this week. It will be very, very frequent, multiple events per week, perhaps one a day. And the remaining Democratic challengers, former Vice President Joe Biden and Senator Bernie Sanders, are all also changing their approach. I'm sitting in my basement. There's a television studio set up down here, and I'm being told by the people who run this thing for me and staff that millions of people, over 20, 30 million people now, have heard what I'm saying. And it's not just presidential candidates adjusting to this new platform. Lawmakers across the country are finding new ways to reach voters. This is wild times, but it's forcing all of us to figure out ways to connect with people. Texas Republican Congressman Will Hurd isn't running for re-election, but he says everyone in office is trying new strategies. I'm going to do, you know, some Facebook lives. I'll do some some teletown halls. Um, you know, the, you know, continue to interact with folks on, on social media. It really is, you know, kind of new age campaigning. McEnany says while you might not see anyone going door to door, those same volunteers are now making campaign calls from home. In Washington, I'm Anna Warnicke.